This is my hovercraft. It's controlled using a remote which is below as shown here. Control is here below. Here and here is the GPS feature. It's not seen now because I'm currently indoor. It shows the temperature monitoring system. All the two thrust motors used in this hovercraft as soon as I press this button. It shows temperature of the two motors. Current temperature of the two motors. Now I'll show you the working of the hovercraft. The hovercraft is fully controlled by using this glove. Right now the hovercraft is in the idle position as my hand is in its resting position. As soon as I move my hand upwards the hovercraft also fills the air up and it floats virtually on top of the ground. Right now it's floating on top of the ground. The direction is controlled using this rudder. As soon as I tilt my hand right, the rudder also turns right. As soon as I turn and tilt my hand left, the rudder also turns left. And this movement turns the forward thrust fan on, as I am going to demonstrate. This movement turns the thrust fan on. I will show you once again. So this is the basic working of the hovercraft, it's completely controlled using this glove. Goes right, goes left, as I put my hand in the rest position, the hovercraft is turned off. In order to turn on the hovercraft, I have to move my hand upwards. This is how my hovercraft works. In order to on the thrust fan, I use this movement, which see my hand. This is how I control my hovercraft. Right now I can move the hovercraft right, like so, after tilting my hand and using this movement. In order to turn it left, I'll show you the working of the hovercraft once again. Right now it's in the off position. Since my glove, my hand is in the rest position, like so. In order to turn the hovercraft on, see my hand. It's completely floating on top of the ground. It's in the. It's flying on top of the ground. What is this? It's completely flying on top of the ground. Right, left. It's completely wireless. The main motor. The main motor turns on using this movement. Watch the main motor. It turns on. Now I'll show you another feature. One of the other feature of the hovercraft is that as soon as it's in the dark region, the array of LED lights on front lights up. This is the front of the hovercraft. The direction of the LED lights is completely controlled using the glove. The LED lights turn on only in the dark time. 
as soon as I turn the light on, the LED lights disappear. Right now the LED lights disappear as soon as I turn on the lights. Once again I'll show you the working. Right now my hand is in the idle mode. I'll lift it up. The house is floating. These are the LED lights I showed before. It only turns on automatically in the dark region. It's oriented to the power for direction. In order to turn the craft off, to switch it off, all I have to do is put my hand down. I'll show you. In order to turn this off, I just do this. Now the craft also turns off as I put my hand in the rest position. So that is my overall power craft. I'll show you the temperature monitoring once again. These are the temperature of the two motors. This is the main motor used to propel the craft upward. The thrust motor used to propel the craft forward. This golden thing is a rudder used to steer the hovercraft. These are string of LED lights that point in the direction of the craft. Center, left, center. I've also provided GPS for the craft. It's not working because I'm indoor right now. <laughs> 